Hey Earth Signs and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your October 31st, 2018 love reading. Happy Halloween to everybody out there. This is my all-time favorite holiday. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I'm going to tip you on down here because we got your first cards out. Um, you guys have the Eight of Wands, the Hierophant in Reverse, and the Seven of Pentacles. So um, you're communicating with somebody. Um, yeah, you're communicating to somebody about a, a commitment that you are leaving. You are asking them to remain patient, um, that you're trying to get out of this marriage or this commitment. The person you are dealing with. Wow. Let me get your outcome cards here quick. Outcome for earth signs. Thank you. And the overarching energy. Wow. All right. Your guys' overarching energy is the six of wands. Success. Um, you're also dealing with somebody who is well known uh, in the community and in, in the world. Uh, this is somebody who people look to for answers, but you're finding success with this person could be with a fire sign. You are moving in very quickly um, to let them know that that things are going to be more balanced, that this relationship is no longer going to have any shared energy. You're reaching out telling them that that you're leaving a marriage or a commitment and that it's just going to take a little bit more time. Um, the person that you're dealing with, a uh, very heavy fire sign uh, here, they have the four of wands. So they're wanting a commitment from you. They're wanting a stable home, a stable relationship, somewhere to build um, together and uh, very, very beautiful energy. This could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, but this person is very uh, stable. Like I said, it's they take care of people. They People come to them for help, um, and they're very good at what they do, but they're wanting to create this new life with you. Let's get one here for the, um, oh, the Four of Wands. Okay. The fool. Yeah. Wow. This, this relationship is going to get off and running, um, very quickly with the fool here. Um, they're ready to take a leap of faith with you. Um, they could have been questioning whether they want to give this a second chance because they were hurt in the past. Um, why is the king of wands here? Yeah. And right now they worked very hard. They're single. They are very, um, yeah, they worked very hard to get to this nine of pentacles energy. Uh, it took a long time for them to heal, but now they are taking their seat on the throne where they belong. And, and they're not sure if, if they, um, wanted to risk being hurt by you again, but they are deciding to take the leap of faith. They are going to jump all in because they're wanting to create this life with you because they do feel that you guys are soulmates. They do feel that there's something special here and they didn't want to lose that. Your guys' outcome for the day is the 10 of cups, the six of swords, and the seven of wands. So um, emotional contentment, emotional satisfaction. You guys are feeling very happy today because you're both deciding to move forward together, moving away from the drama, the um, everybody in your business. You guys are moving away together and you guys are now um, defending the relationship. You could have felt before in the past that they weren't defending the relationship or this is how they felt towards you. Let's get one for the six of swords. Where are they moving to? Yeah, you're moving out of this place of feeling stuck or signs. You were feeling like you couldn't move forward with this person because you couldn't get out of this relationship or commitment that you were previously in. So um, you were sneaking around and keeping secrets um, with each other and you were keeping them from them. Um, kind of kept them in the dark because you were sneaking around with them, even though, um, yeah, even though they knew they really did know this person you're connecting with is very connected to source. Um, they could be a psychic or a tarot reader. 
Um, <clears throat> so they knew what was going on, but, um, but you're no longer feeling like you are stuck in this commitment. You are going for, um, you're taking a leap of faith with this person and yeah, it's going to turn out very, very beautiful for you guys. Um, this is somebody that you possibly could spend the rest of your life with. Um, it's very positive. The fact that you are getting out of that stagnant energy earth sign is amazing. I get one card of advice for our earth signs today, October 31st. So this person is deciding to take a leap of faith with you today um, because they have been kind of guarded. They've been holding back. They've had a wall that they put up because they were scared to get hurt by you again. Your guys' advice is Gaia's Garden. Um, when you get this card, you have everything you need to make your dreams come true. There's no shortage of anything, and you're constantly reminded of the law of supply. Gaia is the infinite spirit manifest in all tangible things. She represents the abundance of nature. When she comes to you as your ally, she invites you to partake in all the blessings of life. There will always be enough for everyone. Success comes to you from the fruits of your intentions, and all is well with the world as a result. This is also a sign to remind you to give thanks and maintain a gratitude of humility and gratitude as your greatest goods now manifest for you. Gaia's gifts are sweeter when you share them with others. So, um, hallelujah, your guys' dreams are coming into fruition. All the hard work, all the hurt that you guys have withstood in the past, all the healing that you've had to do, it is now paying off as it comes into fruition um, you are now reaping what you sow or sign. So congratulations. You guys are manifesting a beautiful relationship and um, the ability and the, and the choice to move together and have a beautiful future together. So I hope you guys have a wonderful Halloween. I'll see you next time. God bless.